Hello everyone! So, Zay Files Diaries 2 has came out and it's been getting some pretty good uh, reviews and I thought I'd pick it up and I've actually been enjoying the game a lot. Now, we're gonna go with a new game. I've, uh, I'm gonna go with this and we're gonna, let's see. Okay. So I'm going to do a custom game. For the most part, it's going to be the same. I've uh, just basically turned down a few of the things because it's kind of grand, um, low, well, not low breaking, but immersion breaking. Like the weather impact. What's going to happen is the game is going to rain for like three hours, then stop, and then start, and then stop, and it's like, what? When the world does that ever happen? Am I in England? No, I can't be in England because, you know, I got guns. <laughs> and I have a custom uh, character. And that's only because, it, you know, you start off with one character. There is a few custom armor and weapons, but they all balanced in... I'm hoping I don't get the right gear I created off the bat because I thought I set that up to be an in-game type deal or really rare. So my character is Damonette. She is a Damon. <laughs> So there is supposed to be a food place somewhere around here, which is good because your character eats like a freaking horse. That is really one thing I wish I could have uh, changed. So let us check out all supplies. Alright, so I have no armor. Oh. I'm gonna switch over to the assault rifle. Now, the assault rifle is probably one of the better weapons out there, but um, I really don't know where this breach is that comes in because I could not find that on any of the uh, creation things. So we got four snacks, uh, eight cooking things. I'm going to first uh, go and spot real fast. That's just a few zombies. Not that bad. So we're gonna go searching. Oh! Nice! Shoulder pads. That is actually pretty good. I want us to equip the shoulder pads. Now as you can notice they have a uh, I don't know why they have really strong uh, uh, arm stats. I mean, when was the last time you seen shoulder pads that cover your entire arms? I haven't. <laughs> the body stat, uh, I think, is uh, a little on the low side, and I think the arm is on a little on the high side. But, oh well, that's just my personal feeling. And I buy onyx. Oh, nice. Rifles, pistols, uh, all very good things. Fifteen cooking ingredients. Alrighty, that's like for enough for three mils. No, five mils. Sorry, it's three each. Now we're not going to want to stay here, we're going to want to move our way around the, the city. Uh, this is where the spotlight is, this is going to be like your first major hangout. What it is, is that when you come here, you're going to have uh, a spotlight that you'll turn on at night. And people will randomly come and join your party. I don't want to patrol. Well, the first day I kind of like to just get all my gear upgraded. 
Uh, cooks meat cleaver. Nice. That's probably going to help me with cooking. Let me see. Yeah, right there. Uh, cooking. Plus three. Combat assault rifle. Ooh, that's nice. So if you notice, my assault rifle now has maxed out combat stats. Its preaching is still shit and its quietness is shit. But this doesn't even have breaching, so you don't want to really use that. Alright, so there's my character eating the first large meal. A scout pistol. Well, that seems like a waste. Well, it's now uh, better than the assault rifle for sniping, so that's a good thing. Later on, when you actually, uh, what's it called, they build the, up your defenses, you'll be able to uh, uh, start building up these things. The improvements, fortified barricades, uh, or once it's fortified by barricades, you can build in a fence, a watchtower, and a sniper's nest. So the sniper nest is really nice because then you can actually use the sniping option. You can't do that without the sniper's nest. Alright, good. Rain has stopped. I'm going to clean up our spillage. Now we kind of want to move our way up towards these areas. So I'm going to scout this out. Now I love the fact that I can choose uh, do I want a low risk, a medium risk, or a high risk. I'm going to go with a high risk. Alright, let's see. The first explode from all sides. Saw several zombies. That's not good. Saw so half a dozen inside. Confident with the results might be medicine inside. Oh, that's nice. So now we're gonna go with a breach. No. I want a breach. There we go. Honestly, I wanna take stop moving everything over. Except for the food. Because food will have a chance of... Uh, what's it called? Expiring. If you go into um, uh, places with uh, zombie corpses. See, I've killed uh, 10 zombie achievements or oh, 100 zombie achievements. So, the first thing I'm going to want to do is clean up or oh, do some exercise. So there was a large mill in there and some soap and dang it. Alright, cool. Well, let us do a quick search real fast. As you can see, now it's rain. See, this is with the weather effect being turned to low. I kind of wish there was a move all button. 
Man, I really think that's a big missed opportunity. There's no zombies inside. Take a search. Ah, nice. Bandage. You'll definitely be using a lot of those. What do we got? Cooking ingredients, a band-aid, a motorcycle helmet, simple meal, nine shotgun shells. Oh, not bad. Could be better. Just sleeping, so I can't really do anything about it. All right, for round seem to be a little on the low side for this run. Good, good, good. Well, then I just go out and I'll patrol. Alright, so this little thing shows you where all the power is at. As you can notice, this section of the neighborhood is actually out of power. Hygienic bar of soap, good. That means it's going to be easier for me to clean up with that. And that's everything. So, I'm going to show off the, uh, what's it called? The, the uh, search, uh, or the uh, spotlight today. So it might be a spotlight inside. Yes, you don't say. That's only where the map is marked that there's a spotlight. I'm leaving all the food because I don't want it to get contaminated. And that just lets you know about what the spotlight's used for. <laughs> You gotta go now and fix the set. Alrighty, nice. So now that the power's fixed for this area, as you can see, everything has power. And we can start turning on the spotlight. Oh man, look at all those zombies. Every one of those dots represents a zombie. Resting, that's not good. Alrighty, what do we have? Survivor, she's 
Said so she's a police officer. Okay, cool. I mean, she's another fighter. And you can only bring in one survivor a night. Oh, yeah, that's right. She's. I was like, I'm going to end up uh, going over here. There's really no punishing effect for uh, encumbering your character. They just kind of move a little slower. Alright. Is my character awake yet? So this is something cool. You can find that there is a few things over here. What day you're on? Good. Good. Well, I kind of just want you to watch. I definitely want that. Whoa! So I've never had that happen before, and I've been playing for a few hours, so that actually surprised me. That was really cool. Oh, why are you insulting me? Okay, okay, that's good. So that is a good sign. It means my characters are now getting along. There, there is still the rumor system. Like, I can go and create a rumor with uh, character A. Let's see. Oh, that's why she does list, likes my character, because my character is young. And we can't do the uh, thing yet. Uh,
Okay, that's good. That's good. Eleven zombies. Wow. Body armor. Oh, stop getting out uh, this along. Both my characters are resting. Nice. Neither one of them was hurt. Resting still. All right, sorry about that. I had to check the time. Well, we still got a good. Uh, 15 minutes. Oops. Now, I don't know if this is something you guys want to see more of on the channel. repair this barricades let's go with the fence the survivor appears what do we got oh she was a carpenter Damonette is sleeping. Oh, it's an electric fence now, huh?
switch over to the sculpt pistol. Let's see how many pistol rounds. Yeah, it's a decent amount. And <laughs> we destroyed all the furniture. Lovely. There's another one of these events. Let's do it. Wait, she's injured? You know what?
Hmm. That's not good. It's... Why aren't you healing them? Because you're resting. She used to be a priest. Of course, the demon would hate that. Everyone in the group would be unhappy. you killed them. <laughs> Kenky. The zombies have to break into the house. Let's see. Middle. It's also elderly, upper class. Elderly. Okay, so I need to. Activism. She's a all three of that girls are gay. <laughs> Leader of the National Association for Concerned Carpenters and Police Officers. Oh, they like me now. <laughs> start moving around I and mean, what we really want to do is get into some of these bigger buildings right here 
but it is going to be more dangerous to do so. I don't want you patrolling alone. Sure, you can go snipe a few zombies. Well, no. I'll probably want you to go and just watch. Okay, so I'm gonna have to make another search and whoa. Interesting. What do we get? What do we get? Oh, she's a survivor carrying a mop in a bar of soap. Ooh. She used to be a bartender. Okay, bartenders have some pretty nice stats. But the mop is real nice. Well, her fever's gone, that's good. So we don't have to kill her. Ooh, that's on the chest too. I want her to have uh, that. Let's see, combat pistol, and we will go with the. Nope. There we go. Uh, Unfortunately, I don't have any body armor for you. I don't know why I keep saying they, 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 when only one person's going in the shower. I mean, I understand when uh, Damonette and the other girl was going in the shower, and it was they. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> I got like four lesbians in my game. <laughs> oh, 
It's like two of them are old, though. Yeah. But you got like two mills preying on the young girls. <laughs> I know, I'm bad. It's still saying they, even though one person went in. Let's see, out of the... Okay, Sophie's better at combat, so she'll come in as well. Go. Honestly, I don't want any of those other weapons. Because all they're going to do is weigh me down when I get inside. Zombies, nice. Search. Ooh, 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 nice. But no band aids, huh? That means that I'm up to 20%. Guess, uh, one thing I haven't noticed is that uh, there hasn't been any talk about uh, uh, me finding stuff on the zombies like the first game. Well, I guess we're going to have to watch out for a little bit. me or is that a hijab or what is that yeah. I'm just wondering if uh, that's like a mid-eastern person and it's like isn't it being a gay illegal over there <laughs> You awake, Damonettes? We really need to get going. Alright, good. Let's get the hell out of here. Huh? 
so let's take a look at our supplies. We've we'll definitely got a ton of shotgun shells. Those are antibiotics, clean, those are ingredients. Zombies, nice. What is this redemption stat? Only 24, huh? Okay. I still don't know why it says that. Ooh, what do we got here? Nice. 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 to just watch. <laughs> Show in the bath. Of course the lesbians would jump into the shower bath together. Right, check a wow wow. So there's like no solid line between my character and all the rest. <laughs> Silent combat rifle. Damn. No. See what do we get? Ooh, and 
she's got song lines. Says she was a teacher. Yes. Now, is she... <laughs> she's gay as well. <laughs> Everyone's gay in this house. <laughs> It's like everyone doesn't like my character, so she's uh, gonna say. No, oh, it's gonna change it. Middle class, middle class, middle class, four. Oh boy. Let's try this. Oh, okay. My character was unimpressed. These two people would probably hate get, uh, straight people. No, no, no. Let's see. I'm gonna bring in. I think I'm gonna bring in everyone but uh, her. somewhat confident with the thing. Oh, someone got injured. Let's see. J. 
Jane, oh, let me heal you. Just because we need to take out some more zombies. Yeah. Is this counting towards my thing? No, it's not. But she is liking me more now that we're sniping zombies. I'm going to check the time real quick. Be right back. Alright, so we are out of time. I am going to, however, in the next episode, if it, you know this series gets a lot of popularity, head for the hospital. Let's hope we can actually uh, get there. If not, you know, maybe we'll hit down here first, first, and then get prepared for the hospital. I don't know how big, how dangerous the hospital is going to be. But we're going to bring in all five of our members. And we are going to um, live in the hospital probably. I think the hospital or the bank or the police station would be the best places to live. Probably the hospital because that probably does have uh, clean stuff. You know, cleaning supplies, uh, showers and all that sort of stuff. I do, however, worry about the hospital, though, because in uh, the safe, uh, the the safe house diaries one, the hospital could be haunted. I know that for a fact because that has happened to me in a few games. Well, I've actually taken over the hospital, and then all of a sudden, ghosts came and killed my people. I know, it's a little funny, but, you know, it, it makes sense, because if there's going to be zombies, why not ghost? So, yeah, you have to be careful with some of these uh, bigger, better buildings. Uh, for the most part, I either went with uh, the pub or the diner, even though those weren't ideal, but they were a lot safer than these buildings. I think I've only been in the police station once in the uh, safe hall diaries, and that was really difficult to hold. Uh, it's like I couldn't even get the barricades in before being overrun by zombies. And is that a f no? That's a farm. Yeah. That might have the greenhouse we're looking forward to. Uh, I do notice they've taken out the machine shops, which kind of makes sense because those were really overpowered. Because they had the, a shower, they had all the niceties, and you could craft practically any type of ammo you wanted. I can't remember if you could craft other things, but it was a nice place to just stay there and just craft the hell out of it. But see you guys next time.